Uh, howdy folks, it's me, Bron, and, um, today I'm actually gonna be doing a little tutorial video, a little something new here. I'm gonna be doing a tutorial on how to make girls like you. That's right, that's right, how to make them like, how to make them want your big peen. <laughs> so, uh, it's, it's gonna be a quick one. Might be a couple parts to it, I don't know. But, uh, yeah, why don't we get straight into things, get into the lesson. Alright, so, um, the first thing I want to get into with this little tutorial here is, uh, something I like to call the circle of recognition. Yeah, the circle of recognition. Now, you guys might be wondering what the motherfuck is the circle of recognition. It's a circle with maybe about 20, 30 foot radius, um, where the girl can be and actually recognize you and make, um, one of three choices. Now these three choices, uh, what are they? They are, one, she can either approach you, two, she could do absolutely nothing, or three, she could run away screaming. Um, the first two we can work with, you know, the first two it's a little easy to work around, get in there a little bit. Third one's tough, we're gonna need to go to Home Depot and get some tools. So uh, yeah, let's, let's get started with the first one, the easiest, she approaches you. So say this girl comes up to you, now what do you do? You don't high five her, this isn't second grade, you fucking idiot. We're gonna need to to start off with a nice comment, you know, like, um... Hey, I have a cat named Rodriguez, you wanna see it? It's something simple like that, and then... Yeah, you can pull down your pants or something, that might work. I don't know, get creative, get creative. Um... But yeah, we'll, we'll leave you. We'll leave you for that. Um, now we'll go into the second option. She stands completely still, just completely ignores you. Um, in that case, we'll be approaching her. So now, say you walk. You don't want to walk like a fucking idiot. You don't want to have your legs like starfish mode. You don't want to do any of that shit. You want to walk like a normal human being. You know, you don't need to have music playing, bum, bum, bam, bum, 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 you know. Um, so you go walking up, and you can usually say something like, Hi, your face is cool. <laughs> or something like that, I don't know. And then, yeah, that'll usually get them to like your big peen. So now, here's the question. It's great and all to get the girl to like you as a person. You know, to like your personality. But how are you going to make them want to um, have your child, have your six children? Well, um, I think it's important to make use of your surroundings in a sort of way that you would like. Oh, maybe there's an old dried up pickle on the ground. You could take that actually and you could put that in your pants. And that would make the girl think that you're... Um, that your peen is really big, even if it's not. Um, so that way, you know, you can get some time to actually speak to each other and warm up, get her, get her to warm up to you before you actually reveal that your peen isn't really that big. Um, and you could use anything. It doesn't have to be a pickle. It could be a old <clears throat> Buzz Lightyear action figure. It could be, um, oh, it could be anything, really. But, uh, yeah. Alright, so now there is the third situation we have to work with. You know, she's running away screaming, and you can't really get good control of her. Um, so there's a number of ways you can go about this. Um, there's, there's an aerial maneuver. I don't think I'm going to get into that right now. It is a little advanced. So I, I think I'm going to stick with the Home Depot, the Home Depot option, um, in which you'll have to come prepared, but it's worth it in the end. So what you want to do... Before you even go entering your radius, your circle of whatever, the poop, um, you want to make a quick trip to Home Depot. You know, the trusted home care store. Uh, you want to go to the aisle that has the chains, and you're going to want to go to the aisle that has the ropes, all those. You're going to want to buy, I don't know, 10 foot chain, depends how fat she is. <laughs> oh god. <coughs> Anyways, you're gonna want to buy a chain, um, so that way you could, 
bring this chain you can wrap it around this female and that way she can't escape from your circle of recognition and you can actually rope her into liking you somehow so yeah you're gonna get this chain you're gonna want to do one of those cowboy maneuvers where they um spin it around over their head like so and then you're gonna want to throw it and then get it stuck around their waist or something start pulling they'll be trying to run they'll be like help me help me and then you just drag it in. no one's gonna notice because you're in the middle of a haunted alley anyways you're roping her in like so and then this is where you can actually start making some moves be like hey how you doing my name is Bron. uh yeah and then you know she'll maybe she'll start to like you um this could also backfire i've known some people who uh managed to get themselves imprisoned for life but it usually works so um yeah i, th I think that'll be good um good way to go about if you guys want to know the aerial maneuver, leave a leave a comment, and I'll make maybe I'll make a separate video about that. But yeah, that's that's the uh, way to get the girl to like you in terms of um, th the third scenario. So yeah, thanks for watching, guys. It's it's gonna be it for my tutorial today. I'll make another part or two um, based on different you know uh, things that might go down. And yeah, if you have any questions, leave a comment. I'm glad to answer. I'm always checking my comments in the videos. But yeah, I'll see you later. Have fun fucking, guys. <laughs> I'll catch you later.